On the question of the rule of law, um, we've seen a lot of changes in the leadership of our security structure over the last uh, couple of days, specifically former Inspector General uh, Hilary Mutiambai and former DCI George Kinoti, former because they resigned. Mm -hmm. The president told us that they have resigned and, and we've seen processes to, to replace them in one way or the other, uh, some in acting position and so forth. I want you to tell Kenyans tonight whether those two gentlemen resigned voluntarily or were they asked? Now you see, you see, you see where we are getting again. Are you doubting the president? The president I'm of the Republic of Nigeria. No, 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 no. Go ahead, your excellency. Let, let's be fair to each other. The president of the Republic of Kenya, Dr. William Ruto, a man with a serious mandate, a Kenyan who is known to be a truthful man, has told the people of Kenya that the two gentlemen have resigned. You want now to ask me to confirm whether they resigned or not? Are you doubting the president? No, well, yeah. let's not go there. What sort of I, I don't think what sort fair. of DCI are you looking for? We, we, are, we, are, what we, are the... we are looking for a professional DCI, not a politician, not a drama queen. We are not an actor. We are looking for a professional DCI. Why DCI officers are in civilian clothes? is because they are supposed to be discreet so that they are able to carry out investigations in a discreet manner. We had a DCI who was always in the press. He made a whole confusion about DCI. We want a professional DCI who will not spend his time on drama, who will not spend time on the press, who will investigate cases properly, mm -hmm get evidence and take people to court and get a conviction. And the details of his investigation should be known by the press from the charge sheet. When it's complete and finalized on the date the plea is being taken, then the press will have an opportunity to know that Wahiga Maura has been taken to court, charged with stealing this and this and this there. But when you prosecute Kenyans in the press, and then nothing comes out of it. You remember, there is a time they said nine billion has been stolen from NOIS. Then they took somebody to court for eight million. Then people were asking, what happened to the 8.8 .8 billion? We want a DCI who is not a drama queen. We want a DCI who is discreet and professional to back the IG. And we want the IG to take charge. You see, we had a situation where the DCI was like in charge of the IG. He was given too much leeway, you know? to even sit on the IG, to even uh, intimidate the DPP. We want the new IG to take charge of the security of the police service. And the DCI is a subordinate to the IG. That is so how they have, that's the law. foresee the roles of a new DCI. Yeah. So